card. This is an um, e-ink uh, smart card uh, based um, uh, display and uh, e-ink surf display. It's a segmented display that uh, is very low power, sunlight readable, uh, flexible, extremely thin, and the battery will last for a very long time. The idea here with these smart cards is that it increases security. You're replacing the three-digit number in the back with a six-digit or an eight-digit number. It changes with every transaction, and these numbers are uniquely associated with the uh, cardholder. The bank knows those numbers, and it provides better security. There's a whole host of other things you can do once you have a display. The surface now becomes a smart surface. Our goal at eHink is eHink on every smart surface. So we made a surface that was pretty much a dumb surface to a very smart surface. And um, as you can see, it's in fairly high ambient light, and you can view the display very well. Mm. The battery on this is the largest component within this card, and this display will last for at least two years with uh, the uh, the battery, which is already embedded inside this card. And it's the now, same thickness as an ordinary credit card. You it is actually the difference. exact same thickness as a normal credit card, and it, it doesn't weigh any more than a normal credit card. If you turn it on the back, you can show us the button. You, you press the button. This is the button that I'm pressing. So this actually gets rid of the um, of a uh, of a dongle, a, a security dongle. Correct. It replaces it. the. So today you have a card and a dongle. This is a combination of the card and the dongles. You're getting rid of the dongle, and you have all of the information right here on this credit card. So. So I'm going to drop this credit card to show you that the display won't break. It's it's a plastic display, uh, and uh, let me see if you can track this. And I'm going to drop it. It won't break. And here's something else I will do. It I'm going to stamp on it, and it's not going to break again. I'm going to stamp on it, that, and it's still not going to break. And uh, just to show that it still works, I will change the image. There you go. There you go. There's a new image on the display. It doesn't broken. And if you think I didn't stomp it properly, you're welcome to stomp it to yourself. <laughs> I'll film it instead of you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, excellent. So those are being used now in Korea and Taiwan. We've and shipped a few million of these uh, displays into the smart card industry. They're used by banks, mostly in Asia. Great.